make a USB sound card, you'll need an old but working webcam that has a mic. You'll need a plastic box, a 100 kilo ohm potentiometer and a 6.5 millimeter socket. Please don't do any of this without an adult supervision. Start by opening up the webcam. Once open, pry out the circuit board and remove it from the housing. Locate the microphone and the pins that it's soldered to. Heat up these pins and desolder the mic. Strip two thin wires and connect them to the mic pins. Solder them in place. Push the insulation as far up into the board as possible to avoid a short circuit. Snip off the excess ends of the wire. Strip two thicker wires and connect them to the thin wires. Now solder these in place. Make sure you don't use copper wire at all for this. Connect the other ends of the thicker wire to the pins of the 6.5mm socket. Check continuity on a multimeter to ensure you've connected the right pins. Now solder all these connections. Cut another two pieces of the thicker wire. These are to be connected to the potentiometer. Connect the left pin to one wire and the center pin to another. Each wire connects to the input and the output, so when the dial turns anti-clockwise, the input is shorted, but when the dial turns clockwise, the input is open and flows to the output at high power. Connect the wires to the pot and solder them in place. Now connect the other ends in parallel to the thin wires. Solder these two. Using some sharp object, poke holes in the plastic box to fit the pot and the 6.5mm connector. On second thought, heat the tool before you attempt to make any holes. Keep doing this till holes are big enough for your components. With a plier, pull out any excess plastic and file down the surface flat. Wrap up any exposed connections with insulation tape to prevent short circuits. Unscrew the nuts of the components, fit them into the box. Screw the nuts back on and tighten them with a spanner or a plier. Saw a slit onto the side of the box to make room for the wire. Bend it off with a long nose plier. If your webcam has an inbuilt light, you may want to make another hole to indicate power. For precaution, cover any exposed circuitry with insulation tape.
plug it in and turn up the volume. On Windows 7 you should see it under recording devices. If you don't, download it driver. You can rename it to a device of your choice to help you identify it while recording. So go ahead customize it with stickers or whatever you want. You have a USB sound card. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more.